Rita Baruti here, career success coach. In this video, we are going to speak about mindset, how to shift your mindset to achieve career success. First, I want you to know that feeling anxious, nervous, sometimes even depressed during your job search or throughout your career, it's normal. You might not always feel happy 24 seven within your job or with the growth that you have in your career, but there are things that you can do to improve how you feel throughout your journey. And we're going to get into that now. Secret number one to shifting your mindset and achieving success in your career. Consistency, having consistent habits. When talking about mindset, we want to understand what the most successful people have done to get to that highest level of success. And we're going to talk through that throughout this video. Number one, we really want to pay attention to how consistent we are with certain actions. If you are in the job search process right now, what do you do on a daily basis to yield the highest level of success or to increase the likelihood that you will land that great opportunity? Really think through what you are putting your effort and energy into on a daily basis. Consistency is number one. Athletes, successful professionals in the corporate world, entrepreneurs, the number one thing they do, they get right, is staying consistent on a daily basis. It doesn't mean that sometimes, some days you might not really have that energy to be consistent. That's okay. Minimize those days though. That is really, really important. Shout out to Mohib who inspired this video. Thank you so much. In being consistent, it does mean you have to remove items that will get in the way of you being consistent. Examples of these, and I did this myself. I took a lot of time, a, a couple of months, when I made a career shift to being a recruiter, I really analyzed the activities I was doing. I was going out with friends way too much. I was watching TV and scrolling on my social media way too much. I'm spending too much of my valuable time instead on those activities that are not going to yield the highest level of success. When I realized this, I began eliminating. I began eliminating and limiting the time I would spend on these activities so that I can spend more time on the activities that are going to yield the highest level of success in my job search, as well as building meaningful relationships that can help me be successful in my career. And once you start analyzing these activities, this is when you're going to have that breakthrough moment of, wow, I'm spending this amount of time on an activity that does not yield anything to me. Let me scale that activity back and spend more time on what is really going to help me be successful. Let's talk about consistency a little bit more. Given this is the number one trait that the greats do have, always, always think through what are you doing on a daily basis? What can you eliminate? X out completely out of your life. This will sound a little bit harsh, but you might want to analyze your friends, your family, how you feel around them, because you cannot be consistent if you are bringing in negative energy or someone around you is not bringing in the positivity that you need. Whether it's throughout your job search, whether you are trying to achieve more success in your career, whether it's even your personal life, you're trying to find, you know, great, great mentors, you really need to analyze who is in your life currently. 
you have to put yourself number one as well. That's another key to stay consistent. Are you putting yourself first? And who are you surrounding yourself with? Another example of consistency in your career, when you are looking to be promoted to the next level, you are looking to achieve the next level in your professional career. What are you doing on a consistent basis? Whether it's daily, weekly, quarterly, annually, these items really think through which items will yield that promotion. Be intentional. Be intentional with who you talk to about receiving a promotion, what action steps you need to take to achieve that promotion. So what can help you be consistent? Secret number two, journaling. So to be consistent, apply journaling. Buy a notebook specifically for your journaling. What you do in this notebook is you are going to analyze your activities. You are going to identify what is going to help you be successful. Which action steps do you need to keep taking to achieve that level of success that you desire? In this journal, you are going to also write down specific people's names that are in your life, your family, your friends, your mentors, coworkers, and you're going to assess who is really bringing that positivity to your life and who is not. If they are not, you are going to minimize the time that you spend with that person, even if it's a family member. You know, family is very, very important. But again, if you're putting yourself number one, you cannot put a family member number one because it's not going to allow you to create that mindset that you really need to achieve the success you desire. A few best practices for when you are journaling. Sit by yourself, have your phone on, do not disturb, no notifications going off, no alerts. Really separate yourself stay in a quiet space and allow yourself a solid hour to think through and to write things down. When you continue to write things down on a consistent basis, everything will come together. That right action steps, you'll identify them. You'll also be able to eliminate those or items that do not serve you very well and do not help you reach that success. Now, consistency is challenging. It's difficult. It doesn't happen overnight. You really, really have to put these intentional action steps together and you have to do them on a daily basis. If you miss, again, a day or two, that's fine. But it really has to be part of your lifestyle, part of your life. You have to incorporate that. Now, how do you expedite consistency? Secret number three, identify a mentor. If you're looking to reach that next level in your career or you need assistance with your job search, really research the mentor that can help you. Myself, I've assisted, again, thousands of professionals with the career advice, helping them land a great job, really expediting their success by sharing best strategies and eliminating the time it need, they needed to take to figure it out on their own. If you want to really expedite success, a mentor who's been there, done that, has a great track record, is going to help you get there. The right mentor will have your best interest at heart. They will make sure that you stay on the right track, that they support you throughout your journey. The right mentor will not allow you to waste time. Time is so, so valuable when you're looking to achieve the highest level of success, looking to find a job, looking to support your family. They do not want you to waste time.
That's why they're going to share best strategies with you and best tips to help you reach your goal. If you are interested in learning more about my mentorship services, hit the link in the comments and please apply. So when you are consistent, consistent on a daily basis with the right action steps and you are taking time to journal on your own, you're spending quality time by yourself journaling, and then you identify the right mentor for you, that is when you will shift your mindset and achieve the highest level of success in your career.